A New Jersey officer investigating a vehicle accident when another car drives by and almost hits him. Oh. Look at that cat like reflexes. He's able to avoid getting hit by the oncoming car. People are now calling this move the cop drop and roll. The vehicle, by the way, was later pulled over and the driver was issued a citation. A Louisville family shaken up after a truck slammed into the front of their home. Yeah, the homeowner had just gotten home after work when this happened. Seconds before, the truck also hit a woman's car and totaled it. The driver now in this is a 10-year-old girl who told a police officer she, quote now, wanted to kill people, unquote, and the homeowner actually overheard that conversation. He couldn't believe what she said. You know, he was like, excuse me? And she said, I wanted to kill people. And he said, I'm sorry, what'd you say? And she said, I wanted to kill people. Where's the parents when this little girl even got in the car? How this little girl even got access to the keys? His five children were in the room at the time of the crash. The homeowner, that is. The family will be displaced for about a, about a month until the home is repaired. Nobody was injured in this. Thank goodness. Yeah. Philadelphia firefighters dug through trash and debris trying to rescue a man who was stuck in a garbage truck. It happened outside a halfway house this morning. Authorities originally thought the person was an escapee hiding in the trash, but roll call has revealed that's not the case. Firefighters removed trash for two hours before locating the man in the compactor section of the truck. Police say the 33-year-old man is suffering from critical injuries. Well, you can imagine. I mean, with the compactor oh there, goodness. that's dangerous. Scary. Yeah. Well, this is a story. Did you ever wear those duck boots? Never. You didn't. No, I, I, did I don't know. I did. Yeah, I know. Of course you did. <laughs> I did. I don't know if they were cool or not, but mom told me I had to wear them. They were L. cool. L. Bean's iconic duck boot is having another record breaking year. Duck boots are so popular, they have gone on back order the past three holiday seasons. And they're even being credited with the company's resurgence. So this season, L.L. Bean did a little bit more preparation and says it'll have enough to meet the holiday demand. There you go, Karen. You can get your duck boots. <laughs> the company is projected to sell about 750,000 duck boots this year. That's 100,000 more than last year and nearly three times more wow. than the amount sold in 2012. Yet my kids are asking for Ugg boots, not for duck boots. That's old as new. Uh, that's I right. I should have kept those boots. And now you could, you could so go cool. on eBay and really pay for Christmas. I know. <laughs>